Hello everyone, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how you can install YQARC plugin for your AutoCAD. So let's just get into it. Um, first of all, you can just go to your browser and then you go to the website. Or you can just say YQARC. Mm, let me click on this particular one that I have here. YQARC 6.74 download and then enter. It will directly take you to all this so you can go to their website directly. So this is their website, you can see www.yqheart.cn which is china okay so you can click on the link all right so this is written in mandarin i would rather use you know english so if you are using chrome you'll be able to navigate between the languages like this so here are some of the versions of yq hack that are here right. however this is the you know the latest one and then that is what is strongly um recommended so i'll click on this one then it will bring me here okay so you can see efficiently is a good tool wherever and this is the script description okay so now you will click on this particular one you can see it is simplified chinese slash english so if you understand mandarin or you understand english you can you know just click on this and download it okay and it is about 15 megabytes you can see it is not that high so i'll click on this one to download it and then automatically it is downloading in the in the tab here so we just have to wait for it to finish downloading okay now the download has been completed so i'll just open it so i'll um, click on this and then open right now i can just let's um let me try to cut it and paste it somewhere here let's paste it here okay and then i extract here Okay, fine. Then here is the folder. You can see the folder YQ Act. Just uh, open the folder, and then you look for a file called setup. You can see the setup, the execution file. So you right click and then you run as administrator. Then yes. Now you click on this first. You can see you have one here. You have one. You have one. I do not understand it as well. So you have to click on one. However, I have um two AutoCAD installed on my system. So you have to pick one that you want to. You know, I have 2016. I have 2018. So right now I want it to work with my 2016. So I will select 2016 and then I'll click on this first one. Okay. Then you have this. Just click on OK. Then it has been installed. Then you can just close this there is no need for any cracking or something it's a free software you know it's a free plugin for free download then if that's done just open your autocad this is my autocad 2016 now i'm opening my autocad 2016 all right so now when you open your autocad this is what you have and then you can just come to the plugin you can see the plugin this is the last one it is yq hack but the language you have here is not english it is mandarin it can be used in mandarin or used in english so now you just have to change this to english so you click on this and then you come to the first tab here then you pick this first one okay and then you can come to language you see language here you have one then you just have to put zero here okay then you click on cancel and then you save okay just attempt to save it make sure you save the change okay then right now when you come here you see this has changed to english you can see yq arc okay and everything now is in english so now you can begin to work with the with the plugin you know having this plugin it makes your work very easier and faster if you want to draw a floor plan in autocad you know you just have to start drawing line offsetting the line trimming the line and doing all sorts like that but with yq arc you don't have to do such you just draw a wall like that when you draw another wall joining another wall it automatically trims it and then you know it does a lot of other things in a simple way so um it makes your work faster and easier it can be used by structural engineers but basically it is for architect okay but sometimes i use it to draw like footings you know footing plan and stuff like that okay so this is how you download install and then you change the language to english if you like the video make sure you give it a like and if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel yet kindly give me a subscription thank you for watching